We've always believed that soil volume is really important for tree health, and it's absolutely true. I've worked for Deep Root for over 16 years now, so I've seen a lot happen in that time. Go around to local councils, local authorities, to try to get them to understand the correlation between soil volume, ultimate size of tree, and how we can better get the soil volume to grow large trees in the urban environment. The cities want to ensure that they're getting value for money, just like they assess value for money for all the other infrastructure. So they want to ensure that they're going to get a large mature tree, and therefore they're mandating in the form of a soil volume standard that they're going to be able to grow a large mature tree. We've talked a lot about the amount of soil volume you need to grow a big tree. And as a result of that, there are scores and scores of soil volume mandates in place across the nation. In order to comply with these mandates, a developer must put in a certain amount of soil in order for the trees to get large. It's very clear that once a municipality adopts a soil volume standard, copious volumes of soil will be provided for the urban tree and we'll end up with very lush green and large canopies within our communities. Now once an agency adopts a soil volume standard that ensures that solutions such as silver cells be deployed on site, Silver cells bring large volumes of uncompacted, aerated, water-absorbent soils so they can grow large, mature trees. We're trying to provide that soil volume for trees. We're alternative to that. The silver cell is such an open structure. We can deliver any type of soil in that system. We can just deliver that soil that tree needs, and we can ultimately get the soil volume that actually is specified.